Hi guys, me again. My name is Bethany Klein and I am an average everyday cat. I do sports photography. That's where I make the most of my money. I also work at Lowe's in the garden center. I do that because I love the flowers and they bring me a lot of joy. I also do some freelance graphics work for one of my spiritual teachers, Martha Creek, marthacreek.com. Check her out. And I have enough income to pay my bills, but I am certainly not what you would categorize as wealthy. And I just want to make that point because online today, see a lot of people making a lot of dough and I don't see that as being a bad thing, but I just want people to know that average is okay. And to find the things that you really want to do and love to do and do them and stop worrying about being a superstar. Be happy and learn how to love 100% first yourself. Well, I guess first God, because, you know, that's pretty darn important in my life. And then yourself, and then everybody else. And doing the things you love to do, that's part of loving yourself. So, that's what we're doing today. We're headed to Fort Lauderdale to get on a plane to Machu Picchu. And I'm so excited, I just can't stand myself. I have pictures of the fam in the bag, so they can come along with. And bring in all you guys along, too. Can't wait. It's May 20th, 2000, 20, 21st, 21st, oh, 21st, 21st, 2018, and we're, we're going, going to Machu Picchu, <laughs> baby! <laughs> this is my good friend Lisa. And this is my good friend Beth. And we are doing a travel log for this wonderful, amazing trip so we can bring you all along with us. We are leaving the homestead. Bye home, love you. And on our way to Fort Lauderdale to get on a plane. We're so very excited. We just asked God for some safe travels and we're ready to go. Check in when we get to Fort Lauderdale. Love you. Bye. Bye. Hi, guys. Oh, we're talking. We're I thought talking we were. Now. We're talking now. Waiting for a picture. We're, we're in kind of close because obviously we're on the plane. Here we go. We're taking off for Peru. We're taking off for Peru. So, six hours. So we will be checking in when we land. Hopefully. <laughs> yeah, no. Well, I meant your battery. Will. Okay, perfect. We'll see you then. Signing out for now. Bye bye. Bye. Are we ready? We're, We're ready. ready. <gasps> we are in the center of Peru, Peru, Lima City. This is the center of Lima. Okay, I think I got it right now. The square. The square. There it is. That's what it is. No we're going, protesting here. No, we're Lots going to the Arch Archbishop's house over there, right there, right behind us. Oh, I'm not sure if you can see. Okay. And then we were interested in the fact that the police, if you can see them right behind me, I'm not supposed to take their picture, so I'm going to shh, shh, quiet, don't say anything, that they're in the square all the time to make sure that no one is protesting. Very interesting. All right, I'm going to show you around a little bit. Hi, guys. This is take two. Our first blooper was taking a picture instead of actually videoing. So we're in front of the presidential palace. And we are in awe of the police standing here, as well as the guards. So I'm going to show you these fabulous people. Hang on. I'm working um, on it. Can we not flip? Oh, it's okay. We'll just do it this way. These are the guards. This is the presidential palace. And then there's police. I'm just going to show you real fast. Um, so, like we said earlier in our first take, uh, happy to have the police in right in front of us and a little intimidated all at the same time with their machine guns. With their machine guns, it's pretty, it's it's pretty something. But we're stunned by the architecture and we're really just taking it all in. So, ciao for now. Went to one of these ATM machines and she asked for 500 soles. 
but the machine gave her only 300 soles. Okay? For that reason, family, I will highly suggest if any of you want to get cash from any of those ATM machines in our country, better to go inside of the bank and get your money from them. Okay? Don't trust those ATM machines which are out of the banks or out of the buildings. Okay? Clear? Yeah. Very good. Let me check it out today. Never thought about that. I very rarely, rarely. some really cool video of the mountains and we just wanted to share the line for the ladies room because <laughs> there's only two once you get off the plane. Here it is. Ready? <laughs> okay, so just so you know, be prepared. Yeah. Don't Sorry. have to pee too bad. Yeah. Okay. I have to pee pretty bad. So. And like we got an hour to where we're going next and I don't think there's any stopping allowed. So make sure your bladder is healthy. Ciao for now. Bye. The name of the school is uh, uh, what are you doing this way, Professor? Fifty-six fifteen. Is the name of the school? Yeah. Fifty-six. That's the name of the school. Numbers, right? Fifty. 650 is the name of the school. Okay? Okay. She's saying that the school does not have a name yet. Okay? So this is just a number of the school. Chicos, a ver qué niños de primer grado, So also the principal Carmen, chicos, escuchen, the principal Carmen works as a teacher as well. Okay, she teaches first grade, second grade, and the third grade. Okay? Ready? We're on. Okay, so we are in the Sacred Valley. I have my tour guide in my ear at the moment because we have these little whisper things that he's telling us all about what's happening. So <laughs> there you go. Okay, now it's a little yeah. distracting. Now we're here. Okay. Hey. So we're going to try to go to the top. There it is. Whoa, there's the top. There's everybody it's, walking yeah, up. It doesn't look as ominous, ominous as it really okay. is. We're Plus we're at 10,000, 9,000, 9,000. 9,000 feet. Okay. And I'm going to give you a quick scan because this place is stunning. Oh Ready? My gosh. Here you go. It's the sundial. This mountain is a sundial mountain. Okay, and our tour is leaving us, so okay. we gotta go. Bye. Ciao for now. Good morning. Today is Machu Picchu Day. We're so freaking excited. We can't stand it. We're in the line to get on the train. And there's the mountain. We'll check in when, when we get there. Yay! Ciao for now. Bye. Hello. We made it. Well, Guess halfway. We're, we're halfway. So here it is. Ready? Three, two, one. Ooh, go slow. Bam. Bam. It's hard for me to see what I'm looking at here, but I'll just show you the whole thing. Thank you. Gracias. The llamas out there. Mm -hmm. And this. 
was not rediscovered until 1911 when an American explorer found it. It sat untouched by humans for 400 years, 500 years. mountains. This is the so you could do the top part. Watch the scenery. Watch the scenery. Uh -huh. That's fine. Stay still. So cool. Hi, kids. Woo! We're here. We're still here. But we're on the other side now. So there it is. We're, I'm going to take it around so you can see more of it. I think this is pretty awesome. Okie dokie. You got to see you when we get down there. This three are from the same material. Yeah? Three are from the same material. These three are 100% synthetic or acrylic. Yeah? But how you can know that? Uh, you need to open and compare always inside. So inside it's, you can look, and it's different. And it's rougher than outside. And sometimes outside is soft because the persons who who say these garments are in alpaca, mm -hmm. they brush outside for getting an apparent softness. Yeah? Mm -hmm. But they don't brush inside. Mm -hmm. So if you are looking for something real in alpaca, these garments are not a good quality. Hi kids. Lisa's not feeling well today, so she is back at the hotel. But we are at Saksakwaman. And I wanted to show you around because it's pretty stinking beautiful. Headed up. And this is from the top, tippy top. There's Cusco, 